good YouTube Devil Day to here back again once again and today people today we are here for episode number 27 if I'm not mistaken of our brand new Pokemon Violet let's play here on the channel can we just pause for a moment we hit that intro like it was not sick city over here god damn one more time one more time what's good YouTube I love it oh I love it you feel it like all right what anyways <laughs> Anyways, you guys, we are back for episode number 27 of our Pokemon Violet Let's Play. Trust and believe your boy is still sick as absolute shit. I honestly wasn't expecting that just now. Um, in the last episode, we evolved a Haunter. God damn, we evolved a motherfucking Haunter in Levensia. And then we headed north from Levensia. Um, and we are still heading north uh, in our journey on the road to... Uh, taking on the Lurking Steel Titan. So if you missed out on the last episode, definitely make sure you go back and check it out. If you guys are hyped for today's episode, and of course you want to show your support as a prominent of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Now, quick team recap for you guys. You see we got our boy Salty Stack, Knackle Stack, level 27, holding the hard stone. Flittle at level 29, Mass Shift at 26, Finizen at 31, Char Cadet is on the squad again at 24. We got to get him leveled up. And then Low Kicks is at 28. So I'm going to tell you right now, before we get into this, I'm going to have a little tiny teeny tad bit of an update right now at the start of the episode. There's just a lot of shit I want to talk about. You know how much I fucking love to talk. Um, so if you're, I don't know, not interested in it or don't care, whatever, don't hurt my feelings, go ahead, skip ahead a couple minutes. And we'll probably be all up in the lurking steel titan's face by then. Um, so last episode, Admittedly, from a content creator's perspective, I was very unhappy with it. I was not happy with my commentary. I wasn't happy with the shit that we got done. I mean, we got a bunch of new Pokemon, but I don't know. Yesterday was just, it was an off day. You know what I mean? Like, nothing bad happened. It was just like, I don't know. It was like, if my brain normally fits together like this, it was kind of like this yesterday. You know, like, I can say what's good YouTube but in my head, it's like, what's too good you, you know? And I'm like trying, I'm fighting to put it all together. I'm not saying I'm dyslexic or anything like that. But anyways, that's the point I was making. I'm sure everybody's had a day like that where it's just off. And I was just, uh, just, uh, uh, yeah. So if you felt like the last episode felt weird or off, trust me, I did too. Um, I feel a lot better today. I feel a lot more in control, in the mood, ready to go. Probably because I only recorded one episode yesterday and I'm fucking ready to get into this game today. I'm so much so ready that I do know we have not had an episode of our Egglock in a couple days. There's nothing wrong with it. I've already done my grinding. I've got everything ready to go. We are literally ready to take on Humalao City Gym. It's just... I really want to play Scarlet and Violet, you know? And when your heart is leaning in one direction, you're like, fuck, 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 fuck. I want to play this, you know, especially just speaking about how off it was yesterday sitting down to record. Um, probably because I only recorded one episode yesterday today. I'm very, very excited and very, very looking forward to recording this. So I figured maybe one more day without the egg lock, we will get back into it. I love the egg lock. I don't want you to think that I'm like intentionally choosing this over that, but I told you, we were trying to finish that before Scarlet and Violet came out because I fucking knew that was going to happen. And you know, same shit happened with God of War. Uh, God of War Ragnarok. We actually have a God of War Ragnarok Let's Play over on Navi the Great. Link in the description. We got first seven episodes up, but I haven't even sat down and played it in two weeks because this fucking game is here. I fucking love Pokemon. Does that mean that I like Pokemon more than God of War? I don't want to say that because I fucking love God of War. I mean, we have a whole new fucking design in the shop. Link in the description. <laughs> Excuse me. God damn. Link in the description. Link in the description. Link in the description. Um... But yeah, we had a whole new design for God of War Ragnarok and everything, and I haven't even been playing it, and I feel bad about that too. But, I don't know, Scarlet and Violet have consumed my life. Everything else has gone on the back burner. I fucking love this game. So, bear with me, we will slowly but surely get everything up and chugging again. Um, it's just this game is fucking incredible. It has a grasp on me, and I don't want to let it go. Um, so much so, yesterday, I mentioned I recorded just one episode. I was sitting there last night, me and Hector were watching um, Wednesday, new Wednesday show on Netflix. And I was like, fuck, I want to play. Fuck, I want to play. Fuck, I want to play. So, of course, you know me, YouTube. We have a box update. 
We changing backgrounds, changing backgrounds. Everybody now, changing backgrounds. We changing backgrounds. Look at the red, then look at the purple. Isn't it so dope? Yes. Anyways, um, I was. <laughs> so now we have the lobby here in our PC box, because you know we say to all them Pokemon, we got a five star, one, two, three, four, five star PC box ready for you. So this here is the lobby. It still kind of works the same way. You know, we have box 15 over here with our uh, current like cycle out Pokemon. This is our team, I guess you could say. All of these Pokemon and our current party, this is our team. Um, and then box 14 just has more um, Paldean Pokemon. And box 13 now has all of our separate forms, whether they're Paldean or not. All of them are over here. Um, and then back here, box uh, 12, box 11. Yeah, these two boxes. These are the parts of the Pokedex that I haven't gotten to yet. I know I had them all separated, like single, um, no evolution, like base mons, and then stage one evolution, stage two evolutions, all that shit. I had them separated. Um, but I just tossed them all together because, as you saw... We started organizing our living decks. <laughs> yes, I started organizing our living decks. Yes, this is the Palmot that we evolved last episode. I thought about it, and even though he is adorable as all fuck, like this Palmy, like dog, this Palmy is so fucking adorable. I think we are, if we have to choose an electric type, we gotta go with Big Belly Boy over here, which he needs to get slacked back on the team here sometime soon. We gotta get him leveled up too. But I think we're going to go with him. So Palma is just chilling. Just chilling. But yes, we are working on our living decks and getting everything. I need to rename this thing to Roundula. Um, But I got a couple boxes done. Need to get another Claude Zire. Um, when I did my living decks in Legends Arceus, I did not use my party members in the PC box. I mean, in the living decks. So, like, they had a separate box just to themselves. Like, the Hall of Fame or whatever, right? Um, so... Mons like Claude Zire over here who we're still using. I'm probably going to get another Claude Zire and slap him in this place behind the Whoopar. But we are here doing the damn thing. Hauntykins is over here. I only did a couple boxes. Um, and the reason that I stopped, um, I, I didn't get any spoilers or anything. I'm completely spoiler free. I didn't go all the way to the end of the decks. Um, but the reason that I stopped here at 151 to 180 like, you see, there's some mods I don't have here. I think this box was, like, I think, like, the first three were I didn't have, and then I had one here, and then, like, the next six were empty, then I had three or four, and I was like, this is not even enough for a box. I'm just going to be counting empty spaces, so let me just wait. So I didn't continue on past that, but everything else that we've caught, all these Pokemon come afterwards in the Pokedex, and we will get them done -zo. We will get them done -zo. Now... That is everything for our update. <laughs> I wanted to include the stuff about, um, hey, say the girl, cut that shit out, baby. Yes. She's so annoyed with me. Every time I tell her to stop, she's like, whatever. Um, but I figured, you know, if you are watching 20, if you're on episode number 27 of a series, you're pretty invested, not just in the series, but everything else that's going on around here. So... Shout out to those of you guys who did the damn thing with the update. I'm going to give you an update code for the comment section, okay? Hopefully no one skips ahead and sees this. I'm going to say... Uh, what's the update code? What do we say? What do we say? What, what, what's the... Uh, what's the... Um... Um... Uh, up, um... 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 Up, up, update. Up arrow. Give me an up arrow in the comment section below. Um, if you appreciated the update and you're here for it, God damn it, Sadie, come here, baby girl, come here, 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 baby, come here, baby, come here, baby. Um, I guess I can throw in one more update. I've been seeing a lot of comments from different people saying, "Is Sadie dead? Is Sadie dead? Where is Sadie? You can't really see her from this angle. Come here, baby. Come here." You gotta take a couple steps. I know you don't want to. Sadie is an old lady now. She's here. I don't know why people think that Sadie is dead. I guess maybe because the Shebas get a lot of love and a lot of light. But Sadie is an old lady now. She turned 10 this year. She's a big baby still. She's my baby. 
but I can't just scoop Sadie up like I can scoop up Sasha or Ivy, so they get a lot of screen time. Like, look, the moment I called Sadie in here and I wanted to show her off, and now here comes the Sheebs. Here comes the Shebas. We have Sheba 1, Sashimi, Zaja. And then Sheba 2. Come here, mama. Oh. Sheba 2. This is Ivy Bear. She's a monster. She's a big baby, but she's a monster. All right, enough. Girlies, go lay down. You guys, updates are done. Box is ready. We are still here in this fortress of solitude because we failed that fucking... I want to say Lanoon. It's not a Lanoon. I want to say that because it's a lion. Um... Look, what the fuck is the name of that Pokemon? Pyroar! Jesus, I kept wanting to say Lunala and everything but what it actually is. But yeah, we had a fucking Pyroar in here, which would have been dope for the decks, but ha 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 ha. We actually fell down here last time because we were looking for whatever that fucking squirt bottle looking flower Pokemon thing is on the map there. I don't know what the fuck that's supposed to be. You think I didn't see this shit back here, dog? Surprise, motherfucker. These fries, motherfucker. Is that LaVincia? Whoa, Rivers. Whoa. Need to stick to the rivers and the streams that you're used to. Not chasing those waterfalls. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. Yo, this Bramblin'? Yo, dog, I'm not trying to fight you. Get the fuck out of here. Not trying to fight you. So, uh, uh, I looked last time. Oh my god, this is the area that I said I wanted to get to before. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, we gotta head back up here to the Lurking Steel Titan. However, I found an outbreak of wild meows. What's up, dogs? Um, are we gonna whoop 60 meow ass right now? I'll see if you're worthy. Shut the fuck up. Speak to me like that. I didn't even know there was a Meow Mass outbreak up here. I feel like I'm missing out on chances to get shinies by not. Come on, Knuckle Stack. Yeah, buddy, look at him go. Yeah, buddy. Fuck him up. Yeah. Fuck him up. Absolutely, Knuckle Stack, defeat that motherfucking Meow. Fight this bitch, too. Hell yeah. Fuck that Meow up. Fight this bitch, too. Hell yeah. Fight this motherfucker too. Bro, you going the wrong way. Dog. Fight this motherfucker too. Fight this motherfucker too. Knuckle stack. Whoop his ass. Fight this motherfucker too. Yo. Our boy Knuckle stack is not playing games here. If you are in Meowth and nearby. Resistance is futile. Look at that. Low kicks leveling up. Where'd the Meowth go? Are they extinct? Get him too. I don't know. We didn't use any like shiny powers or anything like that. I'm not gonna sit here and do 60 of these. I just was. I just really wanted to gas my boy Knuckle Stack up. That's all. He's a Meowth Marauder. Come on. Get him. No, not me, Meowth. You ain't fighting me, bro. You is not fighting me. Look at the little dreepy over there. I kind of want to catch him just so I'll have all three. Just in case, you know. Go ahead. Fuck it up. Um, You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I do not remember off the top of my head what a shiny Meowth looks like. Um, Isn't it like similar to a regular Meowth? Why are we doing this? We're supposed to be going to the Lurking Steel Titan. Come on, let's go, 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 let's go. Let's go, 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 let's go. Let's go. Let's go. But wait, I wanna see what's down here. Fuck them me out, dog. My boy Knuckle Stack. So that I'm guessing is why you're supposed to put the auto heal shit on. So that you can, you don't have to stop. You can just keep going out there. Wait, what the fuck's in this water over here, dog? What y'all doing? Y'all have a permit to be uh, 
in these here areas. I don't know, I'm gonna do it. It's a fucking droopy, you know, it's a pseudo legendary. I feel like I should. Salt cure this thing. Knackle stack. Oh, it wants to infest you, knackle stack. Well, don't worry, you're gonna salt cure it, knackle stack. And I like how knackle stack like slides along the ground as he walks. No picking them feet up. Mm -mm. Yo, do you know how annoying that is? Do you know how annoying a move like infestation can be, Dreepy? Huh? Whoa, 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 don't die. Don't die on me now. Don't die on me now. I forgot that it does damage turn one. Uh, is it nighttime? Time of all? Dusk ball. Is it nighttime? <laughs> I think so. I think so. Mayhaps. Fuck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. On the first ball. That's what we love to see. Okay, 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 okay. Enjoy the new lobby. We just got new wallpaper, painted the walls and everything. Um, so we can't do anything over here. All right. I just wanted to check before we head out of here. Hey, y'all got any shiny meows over here? Let me know. Do let me know. Ugh. Don't do it. Shit. Excuse me. Thank you. I can feel it coming. Look at this. This cold got me out of here quoting the weekend. <clears throat> Alright, enough. Enough, 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 enough. <sighs> Focused. Let's get the fuck out of here. Fuck these meows. I'll come back and whoop your ass sometime soon. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on up here? Ain't shit, apparently. So this whole area is a mine. Like everything north of Levencia is a mine. So then where are the misters? <laughs> I'm kidding. Let's talk about me. Let's talk about you and me. Um Alright, after the lurking still tighten, I'm one hundred million thousand bajillion percent coming back down here. Give me that item. And battling all these fucking trainers. What's in this cave? What y'all hiding back here? <gasps> a nugget. See? That's why you explore right there. That is why you explore. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Excuse me. Excuse me, gentlemen. You can keep on doing your thing over there. Oh, wait. Do they... Hold on. I'm gonna catch... Yeah. Bro. 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 Okay. Because I haven't seen uh, its evolution yet. Bitch! Are you kidding me? All the motherfucking jumps you miss. And that time is the time you finally overshoot it? It's because of the rockets, I know. But I will gladly take that hyper potion. Alright, Lurking Steel Titan. My guess is still a Steelix, but it could be anything. I don't know all the new Pokemon in this game yet. So, my guess is a Steelix. Um, and if that is the case, number one, we need to get Knacklestack out of here. But no, I think with Knacklestack, we're definitely going to click Salt Cure on the Titan. Because why the fuck not? You know, the Titan is not one shot in Knacklestack. Knacklestack's HP is defense. Come on. Come on. Come on. And where the fuck are the Colossals at? That's what I want to know. That's what I want to see. Are we going this way? No, wait. This is not the right way. Oh, there's another Silicobra. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You know I gotta look. You know I gotta look. You know I gotta see. You know I gotta look. You know I gotta see. Um, but actually I have questions now. Hold on. Pokemon Center I can see in the distance. Oh, that's Zapopico. Um, so that is the distance, but quite a distance because you know I have to stop and look at all this shit. All right, we're going the wrong way. So we still need that <coughs> Excuse me, we still need that bag on That we can see on the map we still need that bag on as well as Bro, is this a table as well as whatever the fuck that new Pokemon was I'm not going to forget it. The traveling Pokemon Center here to serve. Really? Wait, I heard 
a gimme ghoul back there too. Yo, this is awful. I cannot stop. I cannot stop. Was the gimme ghoul? Oh, it's right here. I was gonna say I know it wasn't that one that I heard this one. It was loud as shit. But I was turning and I saw that one. Is there another one up here? Are you really a Pokemon Center? I don't want to battle right now. Shout the fuck out to you. I feel like the tent should have been like a Pokeball or something. You know. Pokemon Center just got generic ass yellow tents. Shit. Anybody can just pick up a... Whoa, 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 whoa. About to boost right into his booty hole. Excuse me. I mean, anybody could just buy... All right. All right. All right. What was that? Were we forever falling? And the game was like, get us out of here. Um, excuse me, large and in shot. Whoa, 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 bro, bro, you gonna hurt yourself moving that fast. Chill out, bro, chill out. Where you going? Who you running up on like that? You know, last time I was trying to fight a Hariyama, it whirlwinded me away. Out of here, bro. Big ass boy. Oh, here it is. Come here, boy. Big ass fucking Hariyama come do 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 running up to me. Um, okay, knack my my boy knackle stack. Salt cure this thing. Crunch don't mean a thing. Crunch don't mean a thing. Crunch don't mean a thing. Hey, bad guy. Need you to hop in this ball, buddy boy. So I, I could imagine seeing a shell gone later in the wild, but are there salamence? Are there really salamence out here flying around? Are you gonna see like a salamence with a bunch of little bagons around it? Bro, really? It's nighttime. Don't you know how that ball works? That was the last one I had too, you ass. Now look, salt cure. Fucking you up. Ain't that a shame. Ain't that a fucking shame. You know what? You are the beginning of a pseudo legendary i will give you this ultra ball bro consider this a gift to me it is a one-way ticket to our one two three four five star hotel in the pc enjoy your stay enjoy your stay bag on scale Woo. he would be scaly wouldn't he it's belief that it will be able to fly one day is apparently the influence of information carried in its genes well, bro, Bagons, like a Bagon can't look at a Salamence and recognize that it is the same species. Are they the same species? Do Pokemon evolve into different species? I mean, I guess they would, but like, I mean, I don't know. Look at, look at like, like, look at these Hariyama over here. You know, the Makuido are all around the Hariyama. I mean, whoa, whoa, whoa. I mean, obviously, like they look alike but still you know a bagon can't look at a salamence and be like oh that's one of me i recognize the you know like that's not a thing all right lurking steel titan i have been distracted enough i'm on the way i'm on the way i'm on the way i'm on the way i promise i'm on the way i'm on the way i'm on the way i'm on my way oh my god there's a tower Is it right there? Is the tower right there? Yo, I still haven't forgotten about that new Pokemon yet. I wanna know what the fuck that shit was. Where was it? How come I couldn't find it? Oh! 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 What the fuck is that? Uh, excuse me? Why is there so much shit over here? Damn. Um, sir? What the fuck am I looking at? He ain't got no nostrils. You know he's a mouth breather. I don't know how I feel about that thing. It's kind of spooky. It's a little weird. So that's a new Pokemon? 
For real? So I can get giant no nose worm on the squad? I mean, I didn't think that a fucking engine would be a Pokemon, but lo and behold, here we have Varum on the squad. Not on the squad. Well, he is in the squad box. I will say that. That's what we should call it. The squad box. Okay, hold, hold, hold on just tightly one second, buddy, okay? I don't really know what you are. You look like a mega diglet, but this tower is calling my, my, my name. This tower is calling my, my, my name. And look at that mountain in the background with a waterfall. I want to go there in that. Hello. Sandstorm. Oh, wow. Yes. Excellent. It's exactly what we needed. Exactly what we needed. Yes. Wow. Excellent. Ooh. Oh, that's the Zappo Pico over there because the earth curves. <laughs> right? <laughs> is it? No, it's not. It's over here. East Province Area 3. Oh, it's a forest right there. Oh, I see a Team Star Base over there, too. Oh, ain't nothing else right? I thought that that was the highest point, but no, 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 no. I like how they turn the towers, too. The one that was over by Levencia, that I evolved Palma next to. All three of the fucking ladders are right next to each other, so if you fall down, you fall all the way to the goddamn ground. Alright, look here, bitch. I'm gonna need you to get captured. Because it's a thing that I have where I want to have all of yous. And I missed out on one, it upset me greatly. Oh, you're level 25, they get stronger. Yeah, gimme ghoul, how you feel about that? Little gimme bitch. You little gimme bitch. You little gimme gimme bitch. You little gimme gimme bitch. Come on, you little gimme gimme bitch. Um, I don't know what to do. I don't want to attack him again. I don't want to use my only Ultra Ball. What if we, uh, hey, yo, chuck it. Check it out. This Pokeball's got your name on it. All right, never mind. Maybe we, maybe it was spelled wrong. I didn't write it on there. I didn't write it on there. But that Salt Cure catching up to you, ain't it? I really do like that move, Salt Cure. It's really fucking good. Is there any way to get rid of it at all? Like, once someone Salt Cures you? Other than swapping out, of course. You can swap out, but that's crazy. What? That last one that we had so much trouble with, and this Gimme Ghoul gets in the fucking box that easy? <sighs> okay. Whatever works. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Does it tell me right here? 50 gimme ghoul coins. Who we? Alright, my buddy boy. I think it's about that time. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Everybody wants me to turn the auto heal on, and I'm just like, maybe. <laughs> One of these days I will. Um, I hope that our squad is good enough for this. And we're not struggling throughout the whole battle. I mean, we have low kicks in Charcadet, so. Who says Meat Idon can't fly? Bro? 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 So you thought. But what you don't know about me. Whoa, what the fuck is this? Oh, it's just the other side. I thought there was a whole new part of the map. What am I supposed to do here, bro? Orthworm. The Lurking Steel Titan. Orthworm? Orthworm. Like Earthworm? Orthworm? So this Pokemon's name is Orthworm. And it's a Steel Titan? So it's gonna whoop my ass is what I'm hearing. I'm gonna Salt Cure it. Yeah, we're taking this one. Hell yes! Hell fucking yes! 
I don't. I do not know how to feel about this Pokemon. I need to. I don't know. Catch it. Use it. See what it's meant to be. Damn that fucking Salt Cure. Okay, so Salt Cure does damage based on its HP. Cause what the fuck? What the fuck? Yo, this thing has Iron Tail. Um. Or no! 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 Stop typing your comment right now. Stop it. Stop it. I know why. I know why. Steel and water types are more strongly affected by this move. Boom! There it is. There you go. Which means past me was looking out for past me. Past past me was looking out for past future me by using salt cure. And past me was looking out for future me by using salt cure Does that makes sense there's two past me never mind um i don't really know what i'm gonna do here i don't really want my boy knuckle stack to go down here but i don't want to just keep feeding him podions you know yo bro can you go for something other than iron tail or would you mind missing that isn't that like 75 percent accurate but this is a lurking steel titan so <laughs> mayhaps not Oh, he went for that? I don't believe you, dog. I know exactly what you're gonna do. I know exactly what you're gonna do, Mr. Orthworm. Um, I'm not going for it, bro. I'm just gonna let the fucking Salt Cure do its thing. Like, what, what, what do I gotta do here? We click Salt Cure. Salt Cure's gonna do it. My boy Knuckle Stack looking like a fucking uh, piece of tiramisu stacked on top. <laughs> stacked on top of a piece of cheesecake. Damn, now I want some cheesecake. What the fuck? Yo, that's insane. That this fucking salt cure is whooping his ass right now. Yo, I'm gonna... No, we're not. We're gonna save it for the next battle. I'm gonna click Iron Defense, because why not? He's not clicking Iron Tail anymore. Orthworm. I like, I like him, but I want to know... I'm curious. I want to know more about him. Orthworm. He's steel? Pure steel? Steel what? Um... Orthworm is hurt by salt cure. That's crazy. Orthworm fainted. Damn, dog. I feel like the regular size one's gonna be like tiny. So wait, is he bug steel? Orthworm? Fuck my Pokedex been updated with. Gimme ghoul? Orthworm. Where you at, dog? <gasps> Up here. It's pure steel. Lives in deserts. Wow. Okay. 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 I can get with it. I can get with it. Um. Hey, knock knock. Knock knock, buddy. Don't be mad, cause I salt cured your little earthworm. I knew you were gonna be over here, buddy. And we ain't leaving you. We ain't leaving you, buddy. Where you trying to go? I knew he was gonna come over here to this fucking Urban Mystic and shit. I saw this shit last time. You good, bro? The Titan Orthworm began eating something. Here comes this motherfucker. I don't know what. He's always right on time. Nappy, you managed to pin down the Titan. That's the Lurking Steel Titan. It's, uh, well, it sure is long. Ha <laughs> ha, that's what she said. I think her little friend might be even feistier now after eating those herbs. We're gonna need to do this together, Nappy. Oh, you back, dog? You back and better than ever? You back and better than ever? Well, guess what, bro? I'm clicking it again. Salt Cure not very effective because he's a steel type, but we still click in it. I'm a Salt Cure, you're fucking toad school too. Doesn't matter how big an opponent it is, victory is gonna taste so good, seasoned by my toad school. Um, bro, keep your toad school and his weird ass legs away from my sandwich, dog. I'm just gonna say that. I don't want a toad school anywhere near my sandwich. What you gonna do now, dog? What you gonna do now? You ain't never seen no shit like this before. 
You ain't never seen Parthenon on top of tiramisu on top of cheesecake, dog. You ain't never seen no shit like this before. You use fucking sandstorm, dog. That ain't gonna do nothing but help me. That ain't gonna do nothing but help me. Here's what I found. Shut up. Hey, Arvin. Bro, you are doing... I was gonna say, I need you to do something here, dog. You are doing nothing. Nothing. Look at all this damage I'm doing. Look at all this motherfucking damage. I don't have anything that is... I'm going to iron defense. So that we can... Bro, what? 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 Why? What, 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 why are you doing that, dog? Why are you doing that? Check out my boy Knackle Stack. Fuck yes. Holding it down. Holding it down. Why are you screeching it? Bro, use a move that does damage. You are a fucking ground type. Mud slap it. Do something. Screech. Supersonic. Level 28. Level 28 and you have Screech and Supersonic? Where's the... Oh, you can't use Poison Powder. Where's the Mud Slap? Where's the Mud Shot? Where's the Earth Power? I've been saying that. Where the fuck is the Earth Power at? Okay, you landed your Supersonic, dog. Okay. Wow. So, I mean, other than the one Iron Head that he used, uh, or Orthworm, he's cool. He's funny looking. But I would say he's probably the easiest Titan yet. I mean, we got. I know we're sitting here salt curing the shit out of him, but. I mean, I guess we could go out to low kicks and. <laughs> kick a worm a couple times. Yeah, he don't even want to fuck with us. He don't even want to fuck with us. Look at our defense. Sky fucking high. I cannot wait to see what Knackle Stack evolves into. We had. Salty. Salty Stack. Is it gonna be a. Uh, Bag of salt? <laughs> Can't be a bag of salt. A little of a salt pack? Is that what Neckley? No, he's supposed to be a mushroom, right? Anyways. Grass knot? That was actually phenomenal. I appreciate that. That was actually phenomenal. Look, the sandstorm subsided right as you did too, bro. Can we get a round of applause for our boy Knuckle Stack? Still standing. Didn't take a lick of damage. Salt cured the shit out of that worm. Titan Earthworm. Good job, bro. Good job, buddy. Look at everybody leveling up. Good job, buddy. Anybody want to evolve? No? 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 Okay. 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 That's fine. That's fine. In your own time. In your own time. Hey, we did it. Now, baby. Way to go, little buddy. Did you get a good look at its face, though? I didn't expect a Titan to be such a little cute, eh? <laughs> I mean, I guess, yeah. You could say he was pretty cute. Sure. I bet if we go in here, we'll find more of that Herba Mystica it ate before. Let's go find it before that thing can regroup. Bro, he literally shrunk into nothing. What are you talking about? <laughs> he went from being four stories tall to disappearing into the quantum realm. What do you mean? Before it comes back. I'm sure there's some here too. Is there none? Aha! Aha, bro! Yo, look at our fucking sneakers, dog. Too clean. Too, too, too clean. Yeah, yeah. I knew it! I spy Herba Mystica! Ha ha! Salty Herba Mystica. Do the other ones have. Adjectives or flavors? Another successful search. We're on a roll. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? Well, apparently, salty herbal mystica helps with aching hands and feet. Good for neuropathy and numbness. When you've got muscle weakness, it supposedly builds up strength again. This will definitely help Mabel Stiff feel even better. Come on, Nappy, let's get some feed going. Bro, Arvin, I'm pissed that you spoiled Mas Mastiff's, Mischief's, Mastiff's evolution. Yurt! hey -ah! Sorry to keep you waiting. Here you go. Another of your favorite old Arvin sandwiches, and it comes with a special Titan badge. The Pokemon League might not recognize it, but I hope you appreciate it all the same. It's fucking salt, babe. Path of Legends. I'll take it. I'll take it. We got three Titan badges now. 
three gym badges now, two team star badges now. We doing shit. We doing shit. Is we doing shit? Is we doing shit? Yes. And what are we getting now? Figure this might happen. Don't worry, I made extra this time for that brute of yours. Bro, you gave him to me. Stop calling him names. Hell yeah. I'll share. What happens if you say this is mine? Does he take it anyway? Do you miss out on the buff? Come on, Marble Stiff. Got some for you too, bud. Damn, why'd he come out of the Pokeball laying down like that? But he's such a good boy. This is going to encourage people everywhere to start feeding their dogs sandwiches. <laughs> Whole, <coughs> Whole sandwiches. That's it. Small bites. Excuse me, by the way. Small bites. Mm hmm. Chomp, chomp, snarf, chomp. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa! Miraidon will be able to jump higher now. Come on, at least bother to taste it before you swallow it right down, would you? He said, fuck off. This brute seems to be benefiting from the herbs too, I guess, in its own sort of way. Oh yeah, before I forget, Nappy, take another look at this. There's always a Titan Pokemon near the Herba Mystica when we find them, right? Excuse me. Like the book says, it's not like big old Pokemon just happen to like these herbs. It's actually something in the herbs that's making the Titan so big and strong. Well, how come Mabostiff doesn't get big and strong? How come Miraidon only gets abilities and not anything else? How come these random Pokemon only turn into Kaiju and everything else just doesn't happen that way? So does this mean a Titan's lair isn't really some kind of treasure hoard or whatever? It's just a pantry where the Titan keeps its food? Oh, you're done with your sandwich, Marble Stiff? His little napkin, his little plate. Oh, buddy boy. R rough. You, you heard that right, Nappy. Marble Stiff just woofed, right? Yeah. He's a good boy. Right? I'm not imagining things. Oh, poor buddy. See? See that? I knew I wasn't just hearing things. Oh, Marble Stiff, who's my best bud, huh? Who's the best of boys? You are, yes, you are. Oh, is it, it's been so long since I heard that wolf. Okay, I kind of like Arvin now. He's a dog person. And we started this episode with three dogs. Marble Stiff is definitely getting better. Ever since I teamed up with you, good things keep happening. But we still got two more herbs to go. Hope you'll stick it out until we're done. Oh, buddy boy. He's a good boy. He's such a good boy. Yes, he is. Look at buddy. Little buddy boy. Rotototo. Rotototo. Hello, Nappy. This is Tutor. I detect that Maridon has gained more of its original power. While you're riding upon it, it seems it can now jump higher if you press and hold the B button. If you press and hold the B button, Miraidon will now be able to jump higher than before. If you give the B button a quick press, it will perform a smaller jump instead. Please continue to take good care of Miraidon. Bro, you could text me next time, dog. We good. Um, okay. Show me of these new hops you got. I'm a little, uh... What's the word? Underwhelmed? With the fact that that's it. That's all we're snagging. Um, from this Titan. But let's see. Oh, whoa. That's definitely some hops right there. I know so many other places we could go and explore now. Jesus Christ. Yo, clear this fence for me. Whoa. You little spooky bitch. No, 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 no. Don't be a, don't, don't be a, don't, don't be like that. Get up the ledge. Get up the ledge! 
Okay, is the next Titan gonna make us jump even higher? Are we gonna get a double jump then? I like how it's like, you can jump higher, so I expect to be able to jump over everything. Everything, no questions asked. Bro, get the fuck out of here! What the fuck you zoom, room, 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 do, dooming up on? Fuck out of here, room. Anybody trying to battle you? Not right now. Leave me be. Did you see I just unlocked a new ability? Don't land on that. Ooh. Uh. <gasps> Wait, that's the worm! Get away from me. I gotta go salt cure this thing. Whoa, is this his normal size? Why his cry still sound like a titan? Orthworm. I do like it. I think, you know, I have, I've sat with it. I've thought about it. <laughs> I've sat with it. I've thought about it. And I think I do like it. I don't think I'm gonna salt cure this thing. I think we're going to ultra ball it. Fuck it. Fuck it. We'll do it live. Come on, Earthworm. You know you want to get added to this dex. Added to this dex. It's a five star. Added to this dex. Added to this dex. It's a five star. All right, I'm salt curing you, little bitch. I hope that uh, you live this because you're the only one I see here. Look at all these Pokemon over here. Motherfucker spinning around, zooming around. Everything in here is mechanical. Oh, you notice that? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Whoa, bro, chill. Motherfucker can fly, dog. I don't know no cars that can fly like that. Keep him on the ground. Keep him on the ground, bro. I'm hitting you with this Pokeball. Because it matches. Look at you. You know, when I first saw the uh, Earthworm, when we first saw him when we pulled up. It kind of looked like a... Don't hurt yourself now, buddy. It kind of almost looked like a Voltorb. <laughs> like, that was the first thing that came to mind. Like, look at this happy Voltorb. It's such a happy Voltorb. But, I do also want to know, does it evolve? Because if it evolved, I don't know, it was a Titan. What Titans have we had so far? Cloth, Bombardier, and Orthworm. And the other two didn't evolve. I don't think he's going to evolve. Earthworm Pokemon. This Pokemon lives in arid deserts. It maintains its metal body by consuming iron from the soil. It's 683 pounds. 8 to 683 pounds. Wow. What a girthy. No, he is not going to evolve. What a girthy Pokemon. Holy shit. Eight feet long and 600 pounds. Ooh, wee boy. Tell me we can't get up there? All right, I believe you. Fuck. Cuffin, I love you, little guy, but hold up. We gotta get out of here. Cuffin, Cuffin, Cuffin. Don't do this to me. I'm trying to get to the nice Pokemon Center lady over here and heal my Pokemon. I'm not trying to get fucked up by you. Look at the Orthworm. I actually really kind of like Orthworm. It's growing on me. I like him. I wish that he would evolve. Um, and I kind of sort of get that feeling. Like, um... <laughs> Look at this little boy. Look. No, I wanted to take a picture next to him. Sorry, buddy. I tried. Oh, this takes us to the... Where we first met. Oh, Orthy. So, is his name Orthworm? Like, or in the ground? Orthworm? And is this the Titan? Like, everybody was saying that you can go back and re-encounter the Titan again and catch them. And I'm interested in that because we're doing a living decks and we want to get all forms and whatnot. These... I mean, if there's only five of them that are massive, why not? But you guys said you have to go up to it and click on it. And now that I'm thinking that, I guess... Wait, this isn't a Titan. It's just to go back and battle them again. <coughs> Excuse me. So that you can catch them? I thought they were going to be Titans. 
I can't escape? Why the fuck can't I escape? I already caught one, Don. Don't need another. It just says you can't escape. So this is like a titan battle, I guess. Alright. Or like a trainer battle? A tra an NPC battle? Something like that? Go ahead, do your damn thing, Doug. So I bet you that cloth, back when we started that episode, the one after the Krusty Cliff Titan, and I was standing there and that cloth jumped down at me, was that the Titan? Or was he like on the ground where we first met him, we have to go and click him? Because if that's the case, I don't know what to say then. Uh, bro, can you do us all a favor and just hop in this Pokeball, bro? Like, I was I was more so just curious over here. You could let us go. You could stay in the Pokeball, or you could pop out. Whatever works for you, my boy. Whatever works for you. Don't you worry about a thing. But you're not going to kill my boy Knuckle Stack. I'm not going to let it happen, dog. The Salt Cure is going to get you before that happens. So go ahead. Keep being an ass. Keep picking asinine moves, not letting us go, wrapping us in. Do whatever you want. This tiramisu wall will not fall. Not at all. Whoa, 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 bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you double wrapping now? Chill! I want to get the fuck up out of here. Bro, 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 bro. Check it out. Great ball, just for you. I mean, I want to see, I need more coffee. <laughs> I want to see if, bro, why? Why, you're, that's it, you're dead now. And that means that you literally just wasted all of our times. You wasted your time, you wasted my time, you wasted the time of everybody watching. You wasted everyone's time. Because now look, you're gone. You're done. You're done. You're done. You're done. But hey, at least Salty Snack and Low Kicks got leveled up. Knuckle Stack wants to learn to cover. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. You don't need it. Orthworm tarnished. So will he be able to respawn again, or is that like one and done with the specific Titan itself? I I I, I don't don't know here. I don't I don't know what to expect. Um, but I need to check my mapa. Because we still have that other new Pokemon that we saw before. Never encountered it again because we were lurking steel tightening. But I think that we are going to head on over here to Homegirl and heal up and wrap up today's episode. And I think next time we're going to be exploratizing this whole desert area. Like, in all honesty, I want to see everything. There's another bag on right there I might snag just for GP. But I think I'm going to wrap up today's episode here. If you guys enjoyed, and of course, if you'd like to show your support as a proud one of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And until we see each other again, thank you so much for your love and light. And be safe. I'm out this bitch. Bye.